Yeah, he's a biter. He's a biter. What's up? This is a flying squirrel. Now, you'll hear, oh, we don't have those here, but we do. So, they have a very... <laughs> There we go. They have a very soft fur. As you can see, he's just biting away because he's like, hey man, can you let me go? So these guys will gain access into your structures and your return points up top. Uh, very similar to the same situations that a bat will get into because they're a little bit bigger than a bat, as you can see. So. I'm going to stick him back in here so we can get him off to greater places if he's going to cooperate. There we go. We'll get him on to uh, greater pastures here. Um, but we're actually starting to see more and more flying squirrel calls. Um, a few years ago, if you told me you have flying squirrels, I even would have probably laughed. Um, but, uh, our average call for flying squirrels typically is, you know, used to be two to five a year. I think we're at the point this year where we're already at about nine or 10 this year. This is January, um, which is very common to see flyers this time of year. When it gets cold, you're looking for somewhere warm to go. Um, and they will pick your house if given the opportunity. So if you got a flying squirrel problem, give us a call. Wilkins Wildlife. Bedbug 911, 302-236-3533. Have a good day.